Hello, hello, and welcome to Expeditions, a Mud Runner game. Well, we're going to see about that. From what I understand, this is not even a Snow Runner game, let alone a Mud Runner game. Anyway, let's go ahead and start a brand new game. This is going to be the first time I've ever played this game and the first time I've actually ever seen this game, minus the trailer. And I will actually be playing this with a G27 racing wheel. So let's go ahead and start a new game. Uh, empty slot. Yep. Start tutorial, I guess. And yeah, this is just going to be kind of like a honest impressions. You know what I mean? Uh, considering how much people seem to hate this game. So, so it's going to teach us the basics of driving. Do you think it has a manual transmission this time around? You know what I mean? Uh, I bet it doesn't because they don't, they think we're all a bunch of kids. Anyway, let's press W. No, bro, I have that linked to my wheel. There we go. Started. Now what? Oh, damn it. Hold on. Well, what the hell, bro? I can't even start my car again. Um, press. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't, bro. What are you talking about? It's not even started, you idiot. There it goes. Okay, so I got my clutch in. It's out. Yeah, why can't they put a proper manual transmission in this? I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, we're going to just throw it in auto. Release the clutch. I don't think the clutch matters. Anyway, what are we going to do? Wait, why is it acting weird? Hold on, hold on. Can we rotate our camera? Oh, good, we can. Okay, good. Well, my wheel is definitely not working right. Uh, it's doing a full turn. Let's just go over there with the wheel not done right. Okay. I mean... The visuals look decent enough, right? Can we change our view? Anyway, stage complete. Keep following the markers. Uh, let's see if we could change our view. Oh, we can. Thank God. Okay. Well, the interior looks really nice. Where do we gotta go, by the way? To the H? We might need to adjust our FOV a little bit. Oh, dude, why? Look, bro, I swear to God, I push my brake and it goes into reverse. What kind of BS is that? Hold on a second. No, you idiot. I don't want to go in freaking reverse. Why isn't it moving? Oh, look, we're actually stuck. Hold on a second. We're in all all wheel drive. Oh uh, dude, this thing sucks. Okay, let's throw it in uh let's turn on our locking differential. Excuse me, that's not my horn button, bro. Anyway, back to auto. Uh let's go over here. I think we need to go to the one way over there. Well, I've already had a bunch of complaints. Bunch of complaints already. Okay, stage complete. Uh, to move further, you'll need to engage all-wheel drive. I'm already ahead of you. Uh, of course, you use higher fuel when the uh, all-wheel drive is on or four-wheel drive to engage all-wheel drive. Bro, I'm already in it. Uh, leave me alone, will you? Why does it give me issues? Look, I'm already in it. Left shift. Okay, the game's broken. Let's get it started. Or not. Or not, you know. Or not is the possibility here. I'm holding left shift, yes. And then what? Q? No, we don't have a damn locking diff. Okay, I turned it off. I turned it on. Bro, fucking four-wheel drive is on. You guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna blow this thing up.
Okay, finally got that thing to turn off. Um, I guess we're gonna have to go forward, but... Okay, why is auto reverse? Hold on, let me see if I can turn that off in the settings, you guys. And if you don't know, I'm playing this in 1440p, uh, everything on ultra, by the way. Well, apparently they think a bunch of children are playing this game because there's not even a way to turn off auto reverse. Like, what the hell is up with that? Anyway, let's go. I guess we can't use our brake, right? Because as soon as I push my brake, it goes into freaking reverse. Stupidest thing I've ever seen in my life. Anyway, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, why can't this thing have a proper transmission? I don't understand it. Like, come on, you guys. Do better. Do better. Be better. Anyway. I'm not trying to make this a complain fest, but it's going to be. Uh, let's get through this spot, though. There we go. Check mark complete. Uh, differential lock. Uh, bro. Okay, now you're going to let me do it. If you're completely stuck, you must engage the differential lock. This will prevent... This will help a lot in order to do so. You'll have to shift to a low gear. Oh, that was my problem earlier. Well, I don't mind that because... Why does it pause on me? Anyway, let's put it in low. Which is right here. Let's go ahead and turn on diff lock. Release the clutch. And let's go. You know what? Hold on a second. Let's look at our feet real quick. Does this thing have a clutch down there? Look, this car has a clutch on it. Where's the gearbox, by the way? Well, I don't know how he switches gears. Oh, they're way back there. Yeah, this thing looks like it should have a proper uh, transmission on it. I see the gas pedal. I see the brake. Even though he doesn't move him. Anyway, anyway. All right, let's go. We got diff lock on. Water physics do look good. Mud physics do look good. The graphics in general look really good. Uh, let's get through all this mud, however. Uh, I just don't like the controls, bro. This is a game about driving, and for whatever reasons, they feel like... Um, let's go ahead and adjust our FOV real quick. Okay, I think that looks a little bit better. Anyway, let's get through this thing. I normally play my games in first person, um, I'm not too sure how I'm going to play this one, uh, but anyway, stage is complete. Oh, uh, we need to trade. Interesting. On the left is our inventory, and on the right is the resource area. Select the quest item, add it to the vehicle's inventory. Okay. I don't see the quest item. This thing? Okay, that was it. Okay, now what? Why would I want to put it in auto mode? Okay, let's just do what it says. Okay, we're in auto mode now, what? Press S to re No, bro, I'm not pressing S to reverse. Why would I do that? Look, there's a reverse right here. Why would I put it in auto- Okay, you know what? Screw them. They're a bunch of idiots who freaking made this. Uh, let's just go ahead and keep it in reverse. Let's get turned around here. Uh, we're just gonna peek out the door. There we go, there we go. You think this game was in early access. Um, let's go ahead and put it in drive. And, um, I don't know where we're supposed to go. Hold on. Uh, damn it. Hold on. Apparently it wants us to go in that spot back there. Let's just back up into that real quick. Okay. I need my, my steering wheel fixed. There we go. There we go. Now what? Oh, geez. Okay. Let's go. Why does this feel a little more arcadey than before? Anyway, higher inflation system, adjusting the pressure depending on the type of terrain. Reducing it will significantly improve traction, but the cost of, uh, yeah, yeah, I am aware. To open the tire inflation tool, press T. Okay. And then what? Oh, we can just put them like half or all the way down. Okay. Let's confirm. Yeah, we'll just do it in the middle, I suppose. All right, let's go. Yeah, my wheel, I need to get fixed. Uh, 
I don't like that I only turn it like 15 degrees and the whole wheel freaking turns. So I need to figure out if and how we can fix that. If you know how to get the full 900 degree rotation, let me know. Uh, let's get pulled here. There we go. It is complete. Now what? They're going to recommend fuel canisters because there's long travels. Hold left control. Okay. And then what? Space bar. Oh. So we're just going to refill straight from our little tanks. Okay. Okay. Keep on moving. Go, go, go. All right. Stage complete. You could use spare parts, uh huh. Are you gonna tell us to do that too? Left control, okay. What does it mean, select the damage component? Like with our mouse? Oh, okay. So, like the gearbox? Uh huh. And then what do we do? Press spacebar? Yeah, I guess so. I don't see where our supply of t uh, parts are, but maybe this little gear thing here with the 71. Yeah, that seems probably right. Okay, well, I think we fully repaired it. Now what? Uh, go to the flag. Okay, now what? Uh, Deliver supplies. Press F. Okay. A memory card? Sure. Throw it in the back of the truck. So we got $3,000 for that, really? This seems a little extravagant, doesn't it? Maybe not. Maybe not. So wants us to select the drop-off region. Little Colorado is perfect, it says. Okay, let's go to Little Colorado. And then what? Select. Uh-huh. So what do I do? Just hit select. Wait, hold on. First expedition. There we go. Oh, I see. Free room is locked. Okay, okay. So what does this say? Your first assignment. You have to go to the mountains and install a radio module that will improve signal quality at the base. Okay. Seems easy enough. Truck off-road. Blah, blah, blah. It's watery. Um, bunch of height differences. Requirements. Uh, jack screw. Don't know what that is, but I think we have one. And a side board. I don't know what that is either. Anyway, let's select it. Oh, now we have to prepare. Okay, so here's those jack screws. I don't know what the heck a jack screw is, but... Oh, dang it. Okay. So, we're going to pick this truck because it's the only one we have, right? Yeah. Inventory. Okay. Oh, here's that jack. Wait, how do we move it? Oh, we got to buy it. Oh, okay. Let's go and purchase this puppy with enter. Okay. And what else do we need? None of this stuff, but what else is there? Some kind of anchor. I'm assuming. Okay. That's for the winch. There's some kind of GPS tracker. What can be placed into an airdrop to automatically sell all items inside upon finishing. Oh, interesting. A range finder, light beacon, a camcorder. Excuse me. And some kind of camera trap. Oh, interesting. Okay, anyway, what do we need to do? Go back, I'm assuming. Um, cargo. I guess we should probably take a fuel canister. I don't know if we need spare parts. Let's take a spare tire, however. Where's our money at, by the way? Oh, up there, 33,000. Okay, we, we definitely have the goods. Um, I guess we'll pick up a spare part. I mean, we have the cash. Might as well. And now what? Now what? Back? Okay, I don't know if we have everything. I think we do. Um, Let's just go ahead and hit select, I think. Nope. Back. Okay, looks like we have everything, so now what? Deploy? Start expedition? I don't know. I don't know if I did that right. 
Oh yeah, we did. Check it out. We got all the stuff back here. Okay, will you get off the damn thing over there? Look at this. Anyway, I didn't mean to start it, but it started. Um, if you know if you know how to make it so I hit my brake, and it actually stops and not puts me in reverse, uh, please let me know. But let's go ahead and take off. Um, I didn't see where we're supposed to go. Do we have a map, by the way? Let's go ahead and stop. Oh wait, I can't stop. Why? Because it's got an automatic reverse. Uh, let's press M. Okay, and then what? Okay, so we what, we just want to hit this or what? So it wants us to get to the pond and uh, oh god, this is a really long expedition. Okay, well let's drive over there, I guess. Vroom vroom. Uh, should we do it in first person? Sure. We got it. We got it. Let's get up the hill. We're not getting very good gas mileage, by the way. 1.1. Um, stop. Stop. Oh, I can't stop. Why? Because it doesn't have a brake. Anyway. Use the echo sounder to determine the depth of the water. So we gotta hit tab for devices. This is the echo sounder. Oh, okay, check it out. So that tells us it's pretty deep. Now what? It wants us to drive through that? I don't know if it does, bro. I guess we'll just drive through it. Let's go. We'll see what happens. I mean, I wouldn't drive through it. I would just go I would just go around, you know what I mean? Uh, but we'll go through it Should we put our locking diff on let's go ahead and throw it into low Let's go ahead and throw on our locking diff and all-wheel drive And uh, let's get through this thing Yeah, yeah, we're doing okay. I Mean I have some complaints about the game mostly dealing with its transmission uh, so far I like the rest of this stuff. Okay, so here's the trade spot. We can put our brake on this time though, because we're in low. So let's hit F. What does it want us to do? Sideboards. Oh, we need to pick this up. Okay. Oh, I see. I don't know what sideboards are, but it looks like some kind of storage thing. Okay, let's hit exit. Okay, I think I got it completed. Uh, what does it want us to do though? Drive over to that spot? All right, we could do that. We're gonna keep it in uh, low. Now what? Oh, wants us to drive up there. Oh, exploring nearby mountains using the drone. All right, we could do that. Let's hit tab. Here's the drone. How do we drive this thing? Do drones not look higher than this, by the way? Anyway, um, left control is down, shift is up. Okay, then we just move with this. Okay. Seems easy enough. Yeah, I could look really far down, but I this is as high as I can look up. Is that normal for, for drones? Anyway. So what am I supposed to do? Let's Let's go up a little bit higher. Oh, hold on. Oh, so we were just supposed to fly up here so we can get a look and see how to get to that spot. Okay. Well, it seems easy enough. We just have to go around the bend. And does our, our drone just go back in? It must. Okay. Should we try it in auto? Let's throw it in auto. Do I need to be using my clutch, by the way? Possibly. Anyway, we'll try to use it. Let's see if we can climb this hill. Yep, it's a beast. It is indeed a beast. Um, how's our tires? Uh, we have them fully full right now. Okay, slow it down. Fully full? Yeah, that's correct. The tires are completely filled. Anyway, let's get in this spot. I'm assuming we're going down the hill. I might be wrong though, let's see. 
Uh, use the winch to get your vehicle out of trouble. Attach it to a natural element. Bro, I'm not even in trouble. What do we need to do? Press F. Wait, wait, that don't like the way that worked. How did that even work, bro? I didn't even select it. And now what, F again? What the heck's G do? Bro, it releases it. Oh yeah, you're gonna try to climb this thing? Seriously? Well, let's give it some gas. Let's see if we can get up this hump. I mean, it works. Uh, what do we do? Press R to release. Uh-huh. And then we just go into the spot. Okay. Easy enough. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. A little too easy. Uh, you can also find the winch in the tab devices. Which was right here. And then what? Can we hook it to something? So, like, if we select this, we can go like this. Okay, good. That's the preferred way, I would assume. We don't need it, though. Uh, no, we're just going to climb right on up here. Easy as pie. Not that pie is easy. It's actually kind of hard. Let's hit F. Sometimes in expeditions, you'll have to complete quest item deliveries or complete structure. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Okay, we're gonna deliver. Did I did I deliver anything? I don't even know, bro. It didn't seem like it. Anyway, uh, it says use binoculars. Let's get into this spot, however. Oh, geez. So, okay, binoculars are a great way to explore the map and find useful places. I mean, that's true. Let's press. It. I wanted to use the binoculars, not not the M button. Um, look at the marked area on the map. And then scout it. What do you mean by that? Tab. Okay. There's the binoculars. Okay. So we can look. Airdrop. Um, let's use the zoom feature. Oh, yeah. Check it out. We can actually see them over there. What do you mean return to the truck? Am I not in the truck? What the heck? Anyway, let's exit. And then what? Drive to that little spot, apparently. Using a drone, you can also discover unexplored parts of the map. Uh -huh, I'm sure. Open up the map. Use the drone to discover all marked areas. What, what are you talking about? Use the drone to discover all marked areas. Oh, my bad. I thought it said unmarked. Okay, so what? What do I do? Exit out of here? Go to the drone. Spin it around. Jesus Christ, dude, the uh, sensitivity for this thing needs to be adjusted big time. So what? Okay, so what? I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing. Why is the sensitivity so bad? I have to like move my mouse about 10 times across my whole desk here. Get it together, Saber. Okay, I'm not sure what the heck I'm supposed to be doing. This says explore area. Let's just go up higher. Oh, that's the satellite thing we uh, released apparently. Anyway, turn around, fool. Okay, yeah, the sensitivity is horrible on this. Um, oh, okay, apparently I got it. Okay, I don't like the way the drone controls anyway. Let's go forward. Now what? Recovery. At any time during the expedition, you can recover your vehicle. Okay, that's pretty... Seems pretty normal. I think we was able to do that last time on the old game. Okay, so select the field base. Why would I press tab, by the way? Details. And then enter to recovery. Okay. Now what? We go to this little spot up here? Apparently so. This must be our...
This must be our um, mechanic area. Okay, well, I guess we completed it. What did we get, by the way? We got $2,000. Did we win this truck and this guy? I don't know. Let's hit get rewards, though. I don't know if we won this uh, or we just have it. I'm not too sure. It's not very self-explanatory here. Okay, now what? It doesn't tell me. Uh, exit, I guess? I don't know. Let's see. You want to re... No, I don't want to return to the main menu, you idiot. Colorado, please. Okay, now the other ones have unlocked. Okay, okay. I guess we'll just run down it, right? Okay, so we just need a metal detector for this mission. Not too shabby. Uh, not far from the training base, we left valuable cargo. Use the metal detector to search for objects. Seems easy enough. Let's go ahead and select it. Okay, so this seems like our preparation menu, right? We need to pick the truck we're going to use. Oh, dude, okay. We have a bunch of trucks now. What do we got? A big one, this same one, and then the Don. Now this Don, for whatever reasons, has an exclamation point over here. So I guess we're gonna select this one. Let's go to our inventory. Here is, where's the metal detector? Well, I don't know actually. I don't know where the metal detector is because there's no metal detector here. Okay, never mind. Maybe this is not the vehicle we're supposed to be using. Oh, never mind. We have to... I don't even know how I got here. Hold on a second. Where the heck was I? Oh, devices over here with the little thing. You see it? You click on it. Ah, okay. So then on the roof, we can add this free metal detector. Except for... Did I get it? I don't know, bro. I just double-clicked it. I think it's on. Okay. Exit. Okay, yeah, no, we totally got it. Um, do we need anything else? I don't think so. It's just right around the corner, right? Um, let's go ahead and select... Deploy? Yeah, I think so. Oh, good God. We have to go all the way over there? Um, is that far? No, it doesn't seem like it's too far, does it? Well, let's see if we can get over there with the old Don. Oh! Oh, we start over here. Oh, interesting. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and throw it into auto. It's already in auto. Never mind. Uh, let's release the brake. Let's put on the brake. Oh, guess what? We can't put the brake on because it's got auto reverse. So I guess we'll come up to this spot. Is this where we need to use our metal detector? Possibly. Uh, let's hit our tab device. Let's use this thing. I don't think that's what I'm supposed to do. Let's press F for building modules. Oh, interesting. Oh, okay. So this is like a building spot. We could put a helipad or a, or an essential storage for 10 grand. <clears throat> well, we don't want to do any of that. Oh, I get it. We need to go that way. All right. All right. Um, let's pull out the drone. Well, this is one of the worst drones I've ever seen in my life. Uh, this is the max height I can go. Well, that seems dumb. Does this thing upgrade? What the hell is going on, bro? I see people with drones all the time that are like way higher than this. Anyway, screw the drone. Let's just, uh, drive. Does this thing have four-wheel drive? It does. Uh, let's go into first person. Let's check out the inside of this thing real quick. Okay, it looks really good. Is this a Niv? A lot of Niva? I think it is, you guys. And what is this thing? Another building. Are there lights in this thing, by the way? Well, if there are lights, I don't know how to turn them on. Well, it says headlights are L. I was pressing L. Um, they did not come on, so I guess there's no lights. Well, maybe I didn't press L. Anyway, I got the lights on. Um, I guess we're going to make a right through this way.
Well, the engine sounds are not good. Oh, dang. A dang, a bro. We were not paying attention on this one, were we? Uh, let's go ahead and throw it into four wheel drive. Let's see if we can get out of this thing. Nope, we're a little bit stuck. Uh, let's throw it into low. And we're going to throw on the locking diff. Or not. Oh, I guess this thing doesn't have a locking diff anyway. Dang it, we're stuck. Okay, we're going to have to use our winch. I don't know if this is going to work. And we're about to flip it. Let's see if we can not flip it. Okay. Okay, we got out of it. Okay, we need to be a little bit more careful. Yep. We got to pay a little bit more attention, I think. Why is it going so slow? Is my brake on? No. Oh, I'm in low. Let's put it back into auto. There is a high gear. Let's see if it works. No, there's no high. I lied. Okay, whatever. Climb the hill. Climb the hill. Definitely need to be more mindful of where our tire placements are. Let's go into first and see if we can get up this with no problem. Okay, we got it. We got it. Oops. No, we don't. We don't. Easy, buddy. That's a big freaking dent. Look how slow this thing is, bro. What's the beep? We're going to pull open our map real quick. These are modules. Where the hell is our scanning supposed to be? Airdrop, 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 gold mining. I don't know where we're supposed to be using this by says specific areas but i don't even see a specific area anywhere all i see is airdrops and modules so i'm assuming there are these airdrops yeah yeah they have to be right they definitely have to be okay i guess we're gonna go down this little crevice here and across the lake let's pull out the drone real quick i can't even tell where we're at turn this thing around here hold on okay i think we made a wrong turn in albuquerque oh yeah do you think we can make it down this um cliff safely possibly possibly i'm just kidding i don't think we can make it down as safely let's try it though screw it no, I'm only kidding. Let's go around. I think we're going to have to run around uh, one of these sides. It's a little bit hard to see where you're at. Okay. Okay. We're going down this way. Never mind. Nope. Okay. A little bit further. A little bit further. All right. Oh, oh. Nope. Nope. Oh, did we make it? Uh, we made it. We made it, you guys. The engine says it's broken, though. Let's go ahead and hook up the winch real quick. Uh, we need to tip this thing over. And there's nothing to winch to, so um, that sucks a little bit. Okay, well, I'm definitely stuck. Let's see if we can start it and get out of this thing. Oh, start, will you? It doesn't want to start. Um, I'm not too sure what I'm supposed to do now. Uh, darn it. Well, I guess we could try to rescue it, right? Let's just recover it. Oh, no. It's going to put us all the way back here dude and now it's dark okay okay oh my god and it's still completely completely jacked all right well let's get it started let's turn on the lights and uh let's attempt this again
Our engine's pretty damaged. We can see it over there on the left. Um, we need to go around this time, so... Let's see if we could find the proper... Exit, right? Oh, dude, I'm doing it all over again. All over again. Will you get out of there, buddy? No, no. Get out. Throw it in low. Okay, let's throw it in reverse. Back into low. Back into reverse. Back into low. Okay, I think we're getting it. I think we got it. We got it. We got it. Okay, release that thing. Okay, let's get over there. Um, we need to find a different way down, however. So, I think we're going to try heading to the left over here. And uh, let's see if that works. Uh, this thing sucks, by the way. And then by suck, I mean it sucks. Yeah, let's make a left right through here. Oh, dude, the, the engine stalled. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, I don't have any repair kits on me. I think it's all right. Oh, we're in, uh, we're in, okay, we're back into auto. Okay, dang it, start it up. I don't like that the engine starts automatically when I hit the gas pedal either. either. Like I said, bro, this game, it's like too mainstream. Mud Runners is still the best game that they've made. Uh, Snow Runners is really good, but I still feel like Mud Runners was even better. Okay, okay, we're a little bit stuck here. How do I get back to daytime? It's a little bit hard to see here, by the way. You know what? We're stuck. Uh, let's go ahead and pull out the winch again. Apparently, I'm bad at this game. And there's no, nothing to hook this to. Except for that tree up there. Let's go. Okay, the winch is struggling. The truck is struggling. Nope, we're not getting out. We're not getting out. Darn it. I got this huge rock in front of me. Um, yeah go back to the map let's just recover that stupid thing did we get are we getting charged fees oh never mind check it out we're back we're back at the house let's just go scan those items real quick uh let's see we're gonna pull up in the map and then we're gonna head over to this one and uh yeah yeah should be easy enough right up there on that hill okay let's go Yeah, this game would be 20 times better if it had a manual, a uh, proper manual transmission with like actual one, two, three, four, five gears. You know what I mean? Not this baby elementary freaking child driving. Um, it looks like we can get in up over here on the right, however. Nope, easy. Oh, we should have got it repaired before we came out here. That's okay. Uh, let's throw it in reverse. And then back into drive. Ouch. We got it. We got it. There we go. And stop. Or don't stop because there's no brakes. Damn it. I hate this. How the hell am I supposed to stop, dude? Anyway, let's hit F. Let's transfer that anchor over. Okay. And then what do we need to do? Activate our, um, is this where we're supposed to activate our stupid thing? I don't think so. Oh, no, wait, I don't know. Do I get it? Okay, so I think we're ne we need to go follow those little 
gear things right there, right? Well, it doesn't even tell me where it was. Bro. Bro. Alright, anyway, let's throw it in reverse. This thing is really jacking up bad. Look at that. Oh my god. Maybe we should try to go get this thing repaired. Oh, well, why the hell was my brake on, dude? Did I have my brake on this whole time? I swear to god. Alright, let's just go back to the damn base. All right, all right, all right. Come on, buddy. This thing sucks. Um, yeah, get over here. Let's get this thing repaired. Automatic start is stupid, by the way. Yeah, automatic start is really stupid. Um, oh, we actually have spare parts. Darn it. Let's use them. Or not. Wait, do we? Oh, we do. Let's let's shoot this thing off again. Hold on. Okay, so I don't know what that 19.69 means, but I'm assuming it's like meters or something, and that's just the area we have to go. Or are we supposed to go in this little green or this orange flag? Hold on. Let's close this thing. Let's pull in here real quick. Hold on. Oh. Now what? So red is resources, blue is items, and green is upgrades. Open. Okay, now we got to open up the metal detector. Okay. Now what? F. F. What does it want me to do, bro? It's not giving me anything extra than I already knew. I think I still just have to drive to those things, right? Let's zoom out real quick. Hold on. No, I think that's actually taking us to the garage. I don't see any indicators. Or do you think it's talking about on top of it? You see how that green and red is right there? I have no idea. I have no idea. Dude, the tutorial sucks. Oh. Maybe these are the spots that we need to go to? Oh, I bet they are. I bet so. Okay, well, you know what? I've gone on far long enough. Uh, almost an hour now. So anyway, I've complained enough, I think. Um, if you are interested in seeing me do this more properly and be more serious about it, uh, let me know down below. I will be more than happy to play this game on the channel and uh, do multiple, multiple videos. But anyway, that'll be it for this one, you guys. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And again, my name is Quad. We'll see you guys in another one. Later on, everybody. Later on.